In this video, we'll go over a third example of balancing chemical equations. This example is at the highest difficulty level. This is the equation we'll be using as our example. To begin, let's take an initial tally of the elements. We have four carbons, 10 hydrogens, and two oxygens on the left side. On the right side, we have one carbon, two hydrogens, and three oxygens. Let's first balance the carbons. Adding a four in front of CO2 will now give us four carbons on the right side. Doing a second tally, we can see the carbons are now balanced and we have also added more oxygens. There are now nine oxygens amongst the products. Now let's work on hydrogen. Since there are 10 hydrogens on the left side, we must add a five in front of H2O to also achieve 10 hydrogens on the right side. Updating our tally, we can see both carbon and hydrogen are balanced, and we now have 13 oxygens on the right side. Lastly, we have oxygen to balance. To achieve 13 oxygens on the left side, we must multiply O2 by the fraction 13 over two. Now though this does balance out our equation, it's not possible to have half a molecule. So in order to cancel out the fraction, we must multiply everything in the equation by two. After doing this, a final tally shows us that all elements in the equation are indeed balanced.